Hello everybody, Cole Source Digging Sonai here, and today I am back with another animal encounter. Today's animal encounter is a little one, um, but I just caught him and he is super cool. So let's take a look at him. This is a banded water snake, also known as Nerodia fasciata. That's the scientific name. And he is absolutely gorgeous. He's um, what I can tell he's a male and he's just a baby one. I have one right now at home who is a little bit smaller than this one, and this one has a terrible attitude compared to mine. Um, as soon as I got him, he was biting me and he was musking all over me. He's calmed down um, substantially, but oh, I just, you can't not love um, Neurodia personalities. They're hilarious. Yeah, but this little dude, he is, he is awesome. He's got some beautiful banding on him. See that those orange bands? That's where they're called the banded water snake. And Nerodia fasciata are often confused for water moccasins, which makes them get killed a lot. But in fact, these guys are completely harmless and he only made me bleed a little bit on my thumb, you can see right there. So really, um, a bite from one of these guys isn't that bad. They have an anticoagulant in their saliva, meaning that if you get bit, it'll make it keep bleeding. But there's really nothing you have to worry about. All these guys want to do is just be left alone. Um, and I know this one certainly does want to be left alone because he's made that quite clear. As you can see, he's still being very dramatic. These are a very dramatic species of snake. Um, yeah, they're called water snakes. They spend time in the water. That's why they're called a water snake. Um, yeah, these guys mainly eat frogs, other amphibians like that. They'll, they'll eat fish. I know mine loves to eat minnows. Um, they'll eat insects when they're about his size. And they will eat just about anything that they can get their hands on, or mouth on. Um, they'll eat rodents if they get the chance, other snakes, lizards. These guys are very opportunistic, and I believe that they're one of the only species of snake in the world that has been observed to actually scavenge. I'm sorry, he is really... Um, really flighty so he will whip back now and then but i'm not hurting him i'm just holding him just like that uh you gotta you know make sure not to stress out snakes i'm going to release him after this he does not like um being held um if you ever see a snake in the wild um make sure that you know exactly what it is before you pick it up because you know he could have been a water moccasin and a bite from one of those guys, unfortunately, is not as bad as a bite from just a banded water snake. So always know your local snakes and never go pick up a snake um, that you don't know because that can be very dangerous. And that's why the majority of uh, fatal snake bites have happened. Um, but Oh, he is just absolutely gorgeous. Look at that yellow belly. It even looks different than mine. Well, thanks for watching the video. And, you know, if you liked it, leave a like, subscribe, and tell me in the comments if you'd like to see some more snakes. Or maybe I could end, put a clip at the end with my Nerodia fasciata. But, ah, oh, he is just gorgeous, isn't he? Add on to that video, I want to show you some really cool threat displays of him. What they do is they raise their tail over them to get the predator's attention. Just like that, they curl up and they wiggle their tail. I've noticed that mine does that occasionally as well. Just like that. Super interesting. I don't think that I've ever seen that documented before. Now we're gonna release those little Nerodia, Nerodia fasciata. Here you go, little dude. This is a lot better than where I found you. I know you're a water snake, but, oh, go on. Don't stop threat displaying to me. Go. Go. There you go. And off he goes to the great beyond. So if you enjoyed this video, um, hit the like. And if you're not already, subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment what you think about this little dude. And Cole Sorostig and Sonai, signing out.